So let's assume you crochet <coughs> over the pecking cord and you ran out of the cord. It gets shorter and you cannot continue crochet. What can you do? So cut another piece. If you're in the middle of your work, you can cut the same length as you did before to continue. If you um, think that you need to crochet more, cut a longer piece of cord, uh, fold it in half. And you can add this cord the same way as uh, basically you were starting your work. So there are a few things um, you can do here. First of all, insert the hook into the stitch. Then uh, the pecking cord that you had that is finishing, that is almost done, put kind of in front of you. Then insert the hook also into the stitch of the previous row. So your hook is in the stitch, pecking cord like laying on the top and place the loop of the folded packing cord over the hook. It's kind of behind over there. So you have your stitch, your packing cord, and this right here, a packing cord, the, the added packing cord that you need. Grab the thread and pull thread through the packing cord that you just added. Pull it through the stitch, it's under the cord so you cannot see it, like this, and crochet together as a single crochet, like this. So always make sure when you need to add packing cord, if you ran out of the packing cord. Make sure you crochet over this place with single crochet stitches. If you crochet over double crochet, this will not work very good because double crochet is kind of loose stitch to hold a packing cord in, in place. So make sure you find the right place where you will crochet with single crochet stitches because single crochet stitch is basically tight and this is how you have to go about it. Now, so you made your first stitch. Now I will bring this. This is your new packing cord that you just added. Move it on the top. And the packing cord that is almost done, you don't need this anymore, put it on the back and down. And continue crochet now over the packing cord, but now the one that you just added. And don't worry about the packing cord, just the one that you put on the back. You will cut this piece. You don't need this anymore. And I just continue crochet. I will crochet a few stitches to show you what you will do next. So now you edit your packing cord. And this is your front and you cannot see anything that was going on wrong. And let's see what is going on on the back. And this is how it looks like on the back. So on the back, before you cut anything, before you do anything, pull on this old packing cord, just slightly, a little bit, and pull on the packing cord that you just added. And you see what's going on right in here, this area. Watch it.
So here's this place. You cannot see, barely see anything. So now you can just simply cut this piece. You don't need this anymore. You don't have to worry about it. But make sure that <clears throat> when you are crocheting over that old packing cord that is shorter, that you are really tight in here. And here it is. So this is basically it. 